Hi, my name is Paul Allison, and um, well, I you know I've been teaching Black Boy now for three decades. Um, <laughs> it looked like this three decades ago. So uh, your book looks a little different now. In fact, it's a little thicker too. They found a new version, uh, or that the, they actually republished the second part of the, the novel. That's another story. I'm here to ask you to do an assignment, um, which is to take a Google, make a Google presentation. So you want to take a presentation template that we put up in Google templates called uh, Reading Black Boy, Chapter 1. So there are 10 slides in that presentation. And each of the 10 slides contains an image representing two to, to six pages in the first chapter of Black Boy. So each slide represents a section of the first chapter. Your job is to record yourself and your peers, if you'd like, um, on video. Get it uploaded to YouTube and then insert it on um, at least one of those videos on each page of your presentation. So you can read from the book. You can just simply read um, that section of the book that's identified. Or you can dramatize a section just yourself or with peers or partners. Um, tell your own story that's related to something that's in the novel, if you'd like. That's another possibility. Or um, talk about the novel. Express your thoughts, feelings, and opinions about each of the particular sections. Now, you, you don't have to do just one of those. You can do more than one, if you'd like. Have fun creating the presentation. Each slide in the presentation represents, again, between two and six pages in the Harper Perennial Modern Classic Edition of Richard Wright's Blackburn, just to get the pages right there. Um, let me just review that, though, quickly with you again. You need to do one of these for each slide, but you can do more than one video for each slide if you would like. Read the pages of the book aloud with as much meaning, drama, and engagement as you can. Read to a partner or a group of people to have an audience as you read. Or do a dramatic version of the specific pages represented by one of the slides. Do this with a partner or two if you'd like. Third option, tell us what you think of a particular passage represented by one of the slides. Why does it move you, anger you, delight you, or surprise or confuse you? And a final option is for you to tell a story from your life that is similar or different from the story that is represented by one of the slides. So each slide could actually have uh, all four of these videos if you'd like, but you need to have at least one um, for each of the slides. So here's the, a short list of the descriptive titles for each of the nine slides, each of the nine sections in the first chapter of Richard Wright's Black Book. First, there's a scene of a fire on, on pages two to seven. Then there's something that I want to call Joy of Living. It's his description, description of, of Natchez, um, where he lived at the time um, of his early life. There's a story about a cat, which uh, will stay with you. Um, th then he was forced to fight by somebody uh, very important to him. It's really an interesting story there. At six years old, he was an alcoholic. That's pages 19 to 22. Um, pages 22 to 26, we've got reading, math, race, and religion. Really uplifting story there. But then it dives down in pages 27 to 32, where he's in an orphanage. And um, it goes even deeper. Um, it, the, the, the novel, the book, shifts to 25 years later when he sees his father again, and that's pages 32 to 35. Um, finally, there's um, Richard Wright's biography on pages 385 to 406 that we'd like you to read and respond to or do whatever you'd like on a video just like this. So that's what we'd like you to do. Um, one of the first things you want to do probably is replace this video and talk about the book in general. And um, you probably want to do that right at the end after you finish the other nine slides. Good luck. Have fun. Thanks.